Alright, yo, what is up guys? It's DC Knives here and I'm back with another video. Today I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make a thumbnail on Pixlit for free. Yes guys, I said it for free. You ain't gotta pay nobody to do crap. You could literally do this on your own. It's so easy. So let's just get right into it. First thing you wanna do is just go to Google, Yahoo, whatever. Just search Pixlr.com like so. And then right here, you're gonna wanna click open Pixlr editor. Create new image with, you're gonna to wanna to have it at 1280. Height is gonna be 720. Make sure you click transparent on everything. Everything you're making, thumbnail, banner, whatever you're making. So yeah, let's do the, let me put the name, um, Pixlr, Pixlr thumb tutorial, Pixlr thumb tip. Okay, it's gonna give you the background and then you, what you wanna do is gonna go back to Yahoo, Google, whatever you're using. You're gonna search for the background, right? So you're gonna go to grunge background. It could be whatever background, whatever video you're making a thumbnail for. If it's Fortnite, you're gonna search Fortnite. If it's COD, you're gonna search COD. So yeah, let me just, you guys can choose from whatever you want. I'm just gonna go with this one right here. Save, save image as. I'm just gonna save it to my desktop. Okay, then you go to file, open image, look for the image that you just saved. So mine's right here, grunge background blue. Okay, once it's once it's in, once it's popped in, you're gonna click Control A, C. Go back to the original background and put Control V, and boom, it's gonna go right in there like that. If you want to move it around, just click Free Transform, Edit Free Transform. You can move it anywhere, just like that. Simple. Just right here, look, edit, free transform. It's like that, simple. Okay, I'm just gonna leave it like this. So I'm gonna show you guys how I get my my um, text. And I usually just go to cooltext.com. And then fonts, most popular. I mean, I mean guys, they have like a ton of fonts to pick from. So I'm just gonna go with this one right here. I'm gonna go with the color white. I'm just gonna put how how to make free just like that, and then you're gonna want to save it, save image as. And you're gonna want to do the exact same thing you did with the background. So find the text how to make free. Okay, so then you want to click Control A C and then V, just like you did the background. And then transform you, you could um so you could adjust the font i'm just gonna put it like this so i want it to be centered a little bit so like this how to make free and then i'm gonna go get another different color let's go with this gold right here supernova gold then i'm gonna go with let me type in thumbnail thumbnail like so then I'm gonna save image as boom go back open image open the image I just saved and then once again the same thing control a C and go back V edit free transform just like so and bam like that simple Okay, then I'm gonna add an image into it. Let's just say, I'm just gonna add the Pixlr logo. So make sure with logos or whatever you're typing in, whatever you're getting from the internet, make sure you put transparent background. So there's no white background on it. It's just the, just the image itself, just like this. You see there's no background on it. So you save this, let me go back. Let me go back, okay, save this, save it. And then you're gonna go back to to Pixlr. Do the same thing again. Control A. See, you guys see it's, it. Ha it has no background. So yeah. Control V, and boom, it goes right in there. Free transform, just like that. Simple as that. 
Where should I put it? Should I? Put, oh, I just put it right here. That's, that's fine right here. Okay, and I'm gonna show you guys how to put a glow on it. The glow. I'm gonna put a glow on this uh, Pixar logo. So you're gonna want to click this right here, layer styles right here. Click layer styles. You're gonna want to put outer glow. I'm just gonna make it white outer glow. Then up the size on it. I'm gonna put inner glow and outer glow. We'll make it both white. Okay. Put the size on it. Oh, actually, that's the wrong photo. My bad. The wrong um layer. Okay. So just do the same thing again. Okay. Outer glow. You see size. You see it goes up like that. I'm gonna leave it like that. See? See how the nice that looks? That looks pretty nice. So that's simple. I mean, it's so simple to make a thumbnail. Like it literally took me like an hour just to figure this out. But yeah. Um, I'm gonna add something else like a thumb, uh, not, uh, and I'm gonna add an arrow. So what you wanna just search arrow, transparent, and always make sure it's tra transparent. Make sure everything's always transparent. Cause if not, then it'll come out weird. So save and adjust, save this, file, open. We'll go to that arrow I just saved. Again, it's the same thing you did over and over. Con a, uh, control A, C, and paste it as V. So, edit like this. And you could, let me, like that. All right. And yeah, guys, that's gonna, that's gonna be it for today's video. This is how you make a thumbnail. It's so simple to do. Like, honestly, anybody can do this. And I'll wait, I'll, hold on. Let me show you guys how to save it real quick. You just go click save. And then quality, I usually just like to put the quality at 100. So yeah, just say like that. And yeah guys, that's gonna do it for today's video. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you drop a like. If you're not subscribed yet, make sure you subscribe today to join the DC Army. And yeah guys, this has been DC Knives and I'm out, peace. Everybody in my game is drug addicts. <laughs>